Hello my dear kids, hope you all are doing great at your home. Well, last day we have studied triangle, rectangle and circle. Today we are going to study the next three shapes. Okay, so let's follow. You all can see this is one square. S Q U A R E square. Now here you can see one picture of square. And kids, a square has four sides. A square has four sides. And the four sides of a square are equal. There comes the difference with rectangle. Okay. Here are some things which have square shape. First, dice. Dice is used to play Ludo. Next, blackboard, ice cube, window panes, bread, carom board. All these are having square shape. Okay. So, here is rhombus. R-H-O-M rom B-U-S bus. Now, this rhombus has four sides. How many sides? Four sides. So, a rhombus has four sides. You see, uh, the nimki that you eat, that is most relatable to rhombus. Okay? All right. Some people also call rhombus as a diamond shape. Okay? So, some example are kite that flies on sky. Okay. Ring that people wear in their finger. Also, diamond and traffic sign, fish, all these are having shape of a rhombus, okay? This is oval, O-V-A-L, oval, okay kids? Here, you can see some objects which are oval in shape. What are those? You can see one bat of badminton. Next, there is kiwi, balloon, egg, lemon, rugby ball, then a necklace, watermelon. All these are having oval shape. Their base starts with oval shape. So, in today's class, we are going to study the rest of the three shapes. First, you will write the CW date. Then day and month. After that, we have written the heading. Let's read S H A P E S shapes. S H A P E shape and S. It becomes shapes. Okay. Now, kids, today first we are going to study this. What is the name of this shape? The name of this shape is square because the four sides are equal here. So, this is one square. Here, we have rhombus. This is rhombus. And the last one here is oval. What is the name of this one? Oval. So, today we are going to study this three and draw them. So, for drawing this, the easy way would be to take the squares. You have Already this box is in your copy. So, for doing a square, let's take three here. Okay. Three boxes. One, two and three. Three boxes are taken. Okay. Next again, we will come three boxes down. Again from this side also three boxes. And here, see. We have got one, two and three boxes. So, from all the sides, this shape has got equal height, equal length. So, we name it as square. What is the name? Square. Let's write the spelling. S-Q-U-A-R-E square. Okay. S-Q-U-A-R-E square. Next one. The next one is rhombus. For rhombus, let's take this line as the middle line and draw. Okay. Let's come two boxes down like a triangle 
and then again two boxes here. Again here, let's let's do the same thing and add. So here we got our rhombus. Can you see it? One side, two, three, and four. We got four sides of one rhombus. So like rectangle and square, this rhombus also has four sides. Okay. R H O M Rom B U S Bus Rhombus R H O M Rom B U S Bus Rhombus. So to draw one oval, first let's take some points. One, two, three, and four. Okay. So we have selected four points now. We will join these four points. How? Let's see. Okay, so we have finished our oval. Let's write the spelling. O V A L oval. Let's read from the top. We have written the heading shapes. Under that first shape here is square. S Q U A R E square. Next rhombus. R H O M rom B U S bus rhombus. Next is oval, O V A L, oval. So these are the shapes that you need to learn. Okay, so do your classwork and draw the shapes with the help of scale. Thank you.